In this AI tutorial, I'll show you how to create an animated story with multiple consistent characters in just a few simple steps. AI storytelling is easier than you think. I'll guide you through creating a Ghibli-style animation and show you how to explore other styles. Let's get started. First, we need to create our characters and then place them in different scenes while keeping their look and style consistent throughout the story. To create a character, start by defining their appearance. Details such as gender, age, hair color, hairstyle, clothing, facial expression, and pose. Then, choose the visual style you want. Studio Ghibli, Disney Classic, Pixar 3D, or any other style. Use a solid color background and give all these details to ChatGPT to generate a prompt for your character. I'll use these two characters for my story and move on to the next step. In this step, we write the story and generate image prompts and narrative. Do this in simple steps. First, give your characters to ChatGPT. If you have an idea, share it with ChatGPT to complete the story. If not, ask it to generate multiple story options using your characters. If you already have a story, you can skip this part. Read the story carefully and if you don't like it, ask to change it until you're satisfied. I'll use another story. Once your story is ready, ask ChatGPT to break it down into separate scenes and give you image prompt and narrative part for each scene. We now have image prompts for generating images and narration for generating audio for each scene. Collect all image prompts and narration parts in a single file. This file will be your guide for generating images and audio in the next step. For generating images, I use ChatGPT. Click on Tools and select Create an Image. Then, open the file where you saved your prompts. Since we use both characters in the first image, we need to include their descriptions in the prompt. Just copy each character's description and add your main prompt below it. To keep your characters consistent across scenes, you can also upload the images you created earlier in the first step. You can still generate results without uploading any images, but if you use them, ChatGPT will have a better reference and keep the characters more accurate. Wait one or two minutes, and if the image doesn't appear, just refresh the page. You can also edit the result. Click on the image, use the selection tool, and highlight the part you want to change. Here, describe exactly what you want to modify, like removing part of the hair and replacing it with the background, or adding an object, and ask it to keep all other details the same. Sometimes it may accidentally change another part of the image. If this happens, just edit it again until you're happy with the result. Once you're done, download the image from here. Repeat this process for all your prompts. Collect all the final images in a folder and organize them for the next step. In my case, I asked ChatGPT to generate 15 scenes, but after reviewing the story, I added two more scenes to improve the flow. I asked it to give me new prompts and narratives for those as well. Just keep in mind, in the free plan, each ChatGPT account has a daily limit. You can always upgrade your account if you need more generations. To generate narration for the story, I use Eleven Labs. After logging in, go to the text-to-speech section and add all your narration parts there. Next, select the proper voice from here or from the Voices section. I usually decrease the speed a little to make the narration sound more natural. Then, generate the speech and move on to the next step. If you want to try other text-to-speech AI tools, check out my channel and watch this video. Also, if you want to learn how to generate images in different styles using ChatGPT, watch this video too. Links are in the description below. For animating images, I use Hiluo AI. Sign in and go to the Create Video section. It has different features. Go to the Image to Video tab and drag your image here. Add a simple prompt here and describe exactly what you want to see. 
Use this model if you want to use camera movements, otherwise go with this one. You can also select a proper camera movement from this section. For some of my images, I skip the prompt and just let the AI animate it on its own. And for some of them, I use only camera movement or combine both the prompt and movement. Hiluo AI gives you free daily credits with each account. For more usage, you can check out the available plans. Once you're done, collect all your videos in a folder and arrange them for the next step. If you need more help with Hiluo AI, visit my channel to learn how to create consistent, realistic images using the new feature, how to apply camera movement for filmmaking, how to create a movie, and how to use single character reference and create different scenes while keeping the character same. I used CapCut for editing, but you can also use other editors like Canva, Premiere Pro, or any editor tool you prefer. Import your videos here and drag them into the timeline in the order you want. You can adjust the video speed from here to make a scene play slower or faster. Use this to sync the video length with your narration timing. Add sound effects where needed, for example, fire, wind, footsteps, or animal sounds. You can find them on the Pixabay website or directly inside CapCut. Just go to the Audio tab, choose Sound Effects, and search for the sounds you need. You can also add background music from here to enhance the mood of your story. Then, place your narration audio in the timeline and visually match it to each scene. Finally, add transitions and visual effects based on the flow of your story to make everything feel smooth. Lucy and her father are walking through the forest, ready for a one-day camping adventure. That evening, they light a fire next to their tent while her dad prepares dinner. A curious fox watches them from a distance. Later that night, as they sleep in their tent, the fox quietly approaches. Lucy wakes up to a strange sound. She grabs her flashlight and goes outside. As she follows the sound, she realizes that she has gone too far. The forest seems big and confusing. Soon, Lucy reaches a part of the forest that glows gently. Thousands of fireflies light up the trees and bushes. Her eyes widen with wonder and excitement. Still following the mysterious sound, she arrives a small bush where she finds a playful little rabbit trapped and struggling. The rabbit looks at her with wide, pleading eyes. Lucy carefully helps the rabbit out and picks it up in her arms smiling brightly. She wraps the rabbit in her arms, ready to keep it safe. Suddenly, the fox appears. Lucy looks on in surprise. At that moment, a rustling sound comes from the bushes. A snake is crawling out. Lucy screams and falls back in fear. The fox quickly catches the snake and leads Lucy back through the trees. Her dad realizes that she's gone and rushes out of the tent, calling her name in panic. At that moment, she sees her father and hugs him tightly. She tells him everything. The glowing fireflies, the trapped rabbit, and the brave little fox. They sit together, safe and happy, and a new friendship begins.